Hey everybody, welcome back. Um, I've got a little Target haul. It's like a small Target haul along with a little um, part of it I got from the Target dollar spot. And then I also have a little bit from the Dollar Tree. So, alright. First off, um, I got the Rimmel London. Um, it's the eye makeup remover. This is the oil-free Gentle eye makeup remover. It removes um, waterproof mascara. This is my absolute favorite eye makeup remover of all time. I have not found, I've tried several like from Walmart and Target and places like that. I've never found one that I like better. So anyway, finally found this and I just picked up a different one from Target the other day. Um, it was a Target brand, I'm sure, but because they didn't have this there. So anyway, the Target that I went to today had it. So I was so happy. So I went ahead and picked that up. Um, I also picked up the eyelash and brow brush because when I was watching the eyebrow tutorials the other day, they were using these little spoolies. And I don't have one, so I picked one up. Um, also, I've never used one of these, but I'm going to try it. A smudge pot. There's probably not much to it. Um, this is the e.l.f. brand. It says it's new. Um, it's number 21692. Ain't that sweet. It says long lasting eyeshadow and eyeliner. But it's just this very, very nude, pale, peachy colored. And I just thought that was really, really pretty because I don't have any just like plain natural shades. Um, also, I picked up um, a pair of the natural lash number 1713 from e.l.f. and I actually picked up two of these because they're a dollar a pack I went ahead and grabbed two I, I did find something out though so it may not just be me whenever it comes to putting on the false eyelashes because I have a problem they never want to stick so anyway, I was talking to a friend of mine today and she does wear them and she um, actually was asking me if I use the glue that comes in the, the eyelash kits and I'm like, well, yeah. And she said, don't do it. And I noticed um, on one of the tutorials I was watching the other day, the girl, she was saying the same thing. Don't use the glue that comes with the eyelashes. You purchase a different kind. And um I think my friend paid like $6.99 for the one she got from CBS. And um, so anyway, and she said it was well worth it. She said no problem with them whatsoever. Anyway, she thought I passed that along. All right, also I picked up, this is um, Kate. I don't know, I've never heard of Kate before. Um, this undoubtedly is a line through the Rimmel brand. And was just this really pretty nude color. I don't own a nude lipstick either. So, and I mean, it's like really, it's very buttery. <laughs> you can't even see it. It's literally almost my skin tone color. So anyway, I picked that up. I love the packaging on that too. It's like black and red. My daughter got one that was uh, more of a, it was a pink color and her packaging was black with red writing. Oh, this is number 113, by the way. Um, all right, so Target dollar spot. First thing I picked up was these little rubber stampers. I picked it up because it has the XOXO on there, and that's kind of like my little signature whenever I leave y'all messages and stuff like that. So um, for friend mails and things of that nature. So I picked the stamper up to be able to stamp that with. And then they had um, the fabric tape. It's just the red and white gingham check. And then the last thing I picked up from the Target Dollar Spot because I picked up so much stuff the other day um, and they didn't really have anything at this Target. So that tells me something. Okay, so this I picked up for friend mail. And she's going to know exactly who she is whenever she sees this. But it is little mason jar tags. There are four of them. So 
I don't know what she's going to do with these. I don't know if she would know what she's going to do with these. But they're mason jars. So I picked those up for her. All right. The last thing I did, this is something new. And whenever I've actually used this, I'll let you know um, what I think about it. Elf has a new um, face line out. And I'm going to give it a try because I spend... Um, 20 something dollars on like this little bottle of moisturizer um my little bottle of eye cream okay now this one is the equate brand which was a little cheaper but the one that goes with this set 20 dollars so you know it adds up and this is not the only one that goes to the set so, I decided to give this a try. ELF has a new face care system. Alright, so now once I've used it for about a week, I'll do a review on it and let y'all know how I'm liking it. Um, this one right here is illuminating eye cream with purified water, cucumber, and green tea. It says no parabens, no sulfates, and no... Phthalates? I don't know. You know, I don't pronounce those big words too well. It says purified water and essential nutrients help hydrate and minimize the appearance of dark circles and purifies, oh, dark circles and puffiness for glowing, healthy looking skin. Infused with skin nourishing um, Jehovah vitamin E and cucumber to soothe and protect the delicate skin. I'm not needing glasses. This is terrible. Um, area around the eye. It's also rich in antioxidants, shea butter, and green tea. You use this one morning and night after cleansing your face. So that I thought, okay, that one we're going to give a try. We have a soothing serum, again, with purified water, aloe, green tea. Um, this one... You use daily in the morning and evening after cleansing. Massage a small amount of formula into hands and gently pat all over your face and neck for absorption into the skin. Allow serum to absorb into skin prior to applying other products. This is, it says, this silky serum is infused with skin nourishing. I don't know if that's jojoba or jojoba, aloe and vitamin E to soothe and protect the delicate skin area. It's also rich in antioxidants, shea butter, and grape. Um, this purified water and essential nutrients help lock in moisture to reduce the look of fine lines for glowing, healthy looking skin. So this one is for fine lines. Check, got those. All right, this is a nourishing night cream. Pretty well self-explanatory. And then we have a daily hydration moisturizer. So, I mean, I want to give these a try and just see. If, if nothing else, my face should be very well hydrated. Um, now, the only thing is, I, none of these have um, an SPF in them. So, I will have to figure out something in that area. Well, you know what, though? That's where their makeup comes in because the makeup I picked up the other day has the SPF. So there you go. I'm just supposed to actually get dressed, get dressed. So I picked those up. And like I said, I'll do a review on those after I've used them for about a week. And the last thing that I picked up, I just have to show you. I fell in love with this. Um, Lord only knows whose channel I was watching the other day because I watched so many. And I've never seen her face. You just see her hands. And she had, she's sitting at a table. So maybe that's why I can't really think off the top of my head who it was. But this vase was in the background on her table. And I was like, oh my gosh, I love it. $3. Like I said, I'm working on new room decor and that will go with it. So anyway, hope everybody's having a great and wonderful day. And you know what? I'm about to let you go, but it just occurred to me. I got my little stash here that came from 
Okay. Some of y'all seem to get to keep the strip that the washi tape comes on from Dollar Tree. I asked if I could keep the strip, and the girl told me, she said, takes them to reuse it. So they reuse theirs at my Dollar Tree. Lucky me. All right. All they had was Christmas washi. But that was okay. I didn't have any, couldn't find any this year. So when I found it, I bought every pattern they had. Look at these. And I know some of y'all have already seen all these, but you know what? These are new for me. That one's red and green stripe, by the way. These are new for me. And I bought it all. And when I got to the checkout, I could not have been more happy because these things rang up for 50 cent a piece. And that was a little chevron print. This one has hot cocoa, candy canes, and little wrapped up candies. So, I am set. I do not have to worry about trying to find washies next year. This one right here, I don't have to just use on Christmas. I could do a spread with this one right now because it's still winter. Little snowman. They're so cute. And then this one has a little reindeer, a penguin, and an owl. And then, whenever I got to the checkout line, the girl goes, there's only one, she said, but I hung them up at the end. She said, if you want to go and get the, uh, the little Valentine one, it's got little hearts on it. Now, these rang up for a dollar. All the Christmas washi rang up for 50 cents. I was so ecstatic. So, anyway, I bought the only two I saw of these because my daughters are starting to help me out or not help me but like start joining me with uh, planner planning so anyway I knew we'd get some use out of it and then I picked up these two ribbons to do some of those little decorative uh, paper clips for marking our pages with so okay that that is finally it so anyway um, I'm going to let y'all go. I'm going to see about trying to um, learn my little editing software. Um, for a little while, you're just going to get what you get. So, y'all all have a great night, and see y'all soon. Bye.